I look like a, I look like a an off brand Jedi. <laughs> well, um to some of you, I'm about to look a lot worse. Um I d- Am I a real YouTuber now? Is that how it was? Hey, it's me. But it's not me. It's blonde me. Oh my god, is that Slim Shady? Haha, <laughs> really original joke that I haven't had fucking seven times the day of getting this dyed. <laughs> okay, so, uh, yeah, um, I guess, I guess I'm blonde now. I don't know for how long, because this was, this was, this was 50 quid. Um, this was 50 quid to dye. They bleached it twice. It's a very expensive thing. <laughs> I got it dyed two weeks ago. To this day. Something you guys may realise, I'm not sure, back when I used to upload like more often I guess. My videos are always sporadic, they always come out like one really not often and whenever and also not in the order that I record them a lot. <laughs> so you can't, I guess you won't actually be able to see this but um my hair grows like quite fucking fast. So like I said this was dyed two weeks ago and because of that you can see it's already like really growing out like really going back to the to the brown. So that's good. I'm expecting to get roasted for this. I personally like it. Looking at it in this camera, it doesn't look good. And I'll tell you why it doesn't look good. So I don't know, I went. I just decided to go blonde. Me and Luca from, um, who was in the other podcast at one time. Do you remember that? Maybe, perhaps, probably not. Me, him, and Jack, who's from What Was Wrong With Our Childhood, we were like, hey, we were playing mini golf for one. <laughs> we're like talking about the Blonde Boys video, the old Syndigo sketch. Uh, we're just blonde boys doing what blonde boys do. Jerome was let me have a sip of his brick. And we were like, hey, wouldn't it be funny if we uh, all went blonde? Wouldn't that be a funny thing? That's not going to happen. And I went, I'll do it. Luke said he'd do it as well. Jack pussied out. And so we, me and Luca went and got our hair dyed blonde. I never had my hair dyed before. I was told by one of my friends that uh, I had virgin hair. And now it's not virgin hair. So this is the one part of my body. Also, my hair looks weird because this bit looks fucking silver. Everything else looks gold. Right, because I mean, I guess it is. What am I? I'm making it work. So it's like a mix of colors because they just bleached it twice and went, There you go, done. I didn't know that's how they did blonde hair. I thought they actually dyed it. I didn't just think they put fucking acid in it and went, That's bright enough. I've been wanting to dye my hair for a while. Like, uh, you guys may remember if you've been, while for, been around for a while, something I realized the other day was that this happened fucking three years ago now. That when me and Cameron went to I 60. Two was the last? I 63 was the last one we went to. I did a whole challenge thing uh, and said, uh, because I'd been gone for like two months. Isn't it weird how now I just disappear for two months and that's fine, but back then I was like, oh, I need to be punished for it. I did a thing, I had two spray hair dyes, I had a blue one and a pink one, and I was like, hey, if the video gets more dislikes than likes, I'll dye my hair pink for insomnia. If I get more likes, I'll dye it blue, because it's kind of a punishment, but also, I wanted to go blue anyway. And so, it got more likes, because people are kind to me, I appreciate that. And I, uh, obviously went blue. It was literally a spray, I actually still have one, hold on. Because I was considering, considering going blue again, and that was initially what I was going to do. And I thought more about it, and I was like, I probably shouldn't. I don't know if that'll work with my job, and I don't want to ask, and they say no, then I'll be looked like a fucking idiot for asking if I can go blue. And then Jack was like, you've already been blue, and all these people were like, you've already been blue, but I haven't. It was one of these, it was literally, it was literally this one. It was, well, it was this one mixed with another one. I don't know what I'm doing, I'm like, like I'm a makeup YouTuber, like, this is the brand. Do the, the adjusting thing. <laughs> yeah, it says, uh, it's picks a lot paint, one day wear spray on hair color Hawaii. So it literally lasted the day. It lasted like, I don't know, fucking, I don't know, 20 hours. So I never actually have dyed my hair before. That was just a spray that went on brown hair. It looked okay. It looked all right, I suppose. But I've always wanted to do it. And now I've, now I've got my job, which I'll go into a bit more in a minute. Now I've got my job and I actually have money coming in. I decided, you know, I if I'm ever going to dye my hair, I should do it while I'm young and while I really can. And I might as well take the opportunity. There was a part of me that did it because I was scared of what we would say. And I didn't know if my parents would think it was okay. My dad fucking was like, I don't care. Go ahead and do it. So that's all right. <laughs> but you know, there's always, like, I'm a very insecure person. I think that's pretty clear um, for people who know me. And maybe across from here. Um, maybe that's you. That's why I hate it so much. Because I am I hate me. <laughs> but yeah, I was like, I don't know. I, I, I just never wanted to do it because of that. But I don't know. This summer, I just decided, fuck it. And I'm going to do it. And so I actually did it. And I, I still was undecided the morning of the hair dye. But I just tried to like not think about it. And not think, okay, I'm about to do this thing. Which is like very... It's going to change how I look for the next like two months or something. I just kind of think about it. And then 
there was bleach in my head, so it was too late, and then I could just had no choice from then on. And like I said, I I didn't like it at first. I really didn't fucking like it at first. But now I'm getting used to it, and now I look at pictures of me with brown hair, and I'm like, that looks really weird. It's like the opposite of how I looked at myself the day the hair died. Now it looks like that's fake, and this is re it's all weird. You guys probably hate it. I'm really curious to see what some of my online friends think, because this is fucking... Yeah, I'm a real YouTuber now, right? Part of 2014, 2016 YouTube? Markiplier? <laughs> also, yeah, um, I'm gonna stop trying to make videos again now. Um, I know it disappeared for a fucking long time. There is a reason. I know I kind of went into it a little bit in the Things Are Getting Real video, but also it didn't because it came out like a month after I recorded it and so much shit had changed. This summer was good in a, in a lot of ways, but it was also kind of weird in others. This summer, um, a lot of stuff happened. I, you know, got my first car which is fucking crazy i'm i've started driving lessons i've got my first job and i started working a shit ton i started working five days a week because i work at a restaurant by the way and the government scheme of eat out to help out which are they not gonna acknowledge how funny that name is ever okay essentially if you're in america you don't know what the fuck i'm talking about in the uk the government decided for some reason. Uh, during the month of August, um, because of the whole COVID thing, that they would do a thing that for Monday through Wednesdays, you could you could go to a restaurant or a takeaway place and just eat in. And if you ate in, then you would get like half off of the price of it and the government would pay that price kind of thing. Which I don't really understand why. If COVID is still happening and we're meant to be staying safe, why would you encourage us to go and eat in a public space? Also, if you went to like a, a fucking fast food place like McDonald's and asked to take the food out or went for the drive through you wouldn't get the money off. So you have to put yourself in danger and eat in the establishment. So, brilliant boy, Boris. So because of that, I had to, uh, I was working a lot and I had a huge uh, project for, for college also, which I had to do. Um, I still haven't finished. I have one more thing to finish. It's right next to me and I'm going into college tomorrow at the time of uh, recording this, so that's fun. But yeah, my entire summer was took up of working five days a week, sleeping one day because I was tired, doing the other work uh, the other day. Now, obviously, I've done the work. I'm working less. So now I can go back to YouTube. There would have just been no way for me to healthily and in a way that made sense make videos at the same time as all that other stuff without not finishing the the, uh, the college work I had or being too tired for work and all this stuff. So that's why things weren't really happening. But now I have time again. You know, I have college, which is obviously going to take up time, but college is in the day and then I'm working less in the week. So I will have time to make videos again. And that's going to be good. Let's see how long, how many videos this lasts for. I don't actually know. I have some videos recorded where I don't have this hair. I think I have another one, but I don't even have a face cam on, so that's fine. So I don't know when they're going to fucking come out. Yeah, I guess that was the video. There was nothing really to say in this video. I don't even know what I'm going to call it. Which has died or something stupid. Also, um, I have, I have, I have, I have this. <laughs> so, yeah. So I made money, right? I've been supporting myself for the first time in like a, a ever by getting my own money in, right? Which I talked about in the last video. I was like, this is gonna be really cool. I wanna support myself. And I've been saving up money. I don't know what for. So I really bought a lot of things. Um, but the first thing I did buy was an automaton. Now, if you don't know what one of these lovely boys is, it's a Japanese instrument where this is a little face and you squeeze the face to make the volume louder and these sticks make a noise. I'll turn it up on and actually show you. The basic gist is, That looks beautiful in the capture. <laughs> that's the, that's the, that's the instrument. This isn't even mine. I brought this for my, um, to get, give for one of my friends. So he might see this, but he doesn't watch the channel anyway. So he, he probably won't see it. But now I'm not sure. Now I want to keep it. This is 23 pounds 70. I bid it on it on eBay and it's pre-owned. So this is a pre-owned thing I spent 24 pounds on that I'm not even keeping. <laughs> Fuck it. There you go, I should, uh, I should leave for another two months now, shouldn't I? Let me know what you think of, uh, of Blonde Will. If it's mean, maybe don't. I know how long this is going to last. Like I said, I, I do like it. I personally like it. I know a lot of people probably won't, but I personally like it now. But it is going to be expensive to keep up with. Maybe I could find someone that does it cheaper. 
because 50 pounds every month is a lot of fucking money maybe i, I don't know we'll, we'll see We'll see. We'll glitch. See. Haha. <laughs> and yeah, um, I guess that's the video. Honestly, hope you've all been good. Uh, this is the first summer in, I think, the past two or three years where I haven't gotten, like, a bit depressed during the summer. One of my friends calls it seasonal depression. I always get a thing where, like, in the summer, I feel like I should be doing things. And because, obviously, I'm staying in a lot of the time because I'm not a very busy person, usually. I always feel like, oh, I'm wasting time of my life and stuff like that. It's pretty deep but this is the first summer like that i did a lot i did this i got a job i feel like i did a lot this summer especially considering the situation we're in right now and i feel proud of myself for what i did this summer and that's that's good i wish i did this more as well but it was just it just wasn't feasible i will be coming back to it i am coming back to it i've come back to it <laughs> anyway that's gonna be the video uh, see you see you next video. Hopefully I don't record it too far from here. You better see how this grows out even worse That's gonna be far. Anyway, yeah, see you soon. Maybe in a week or something and So good to my friends do I still do that? I don't I don't remember if I'd still still did that as an outro. I think I do Subscribe and bye <laughs>